Hello everybody, welcome to another Sweaty Claw Bash team matchup. We've got Eskiza with a pretty meaty chaos team. 13 players. A bunch of Claw Mighty. And a Tackle Claw Pommer. And a decent carrier there, strength 4. Lot sure hands. But he's been blissed on by the Chorfs. We have an adjunct bull, another decent bull, claw pom, chorf, a couple of claw mighties. Uh, interesting game. I mean, I'd, I'd fancy the uh, the chaos, but anything can happen, especially especially when the uh, chorf start off with two offensive drives. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, unbelievably not scary. Good, good freeing up of the guard. There's no stand firm here. Oh, sorry, there is stand firm. So push is no good. I don't think a push would be good anyway. You can run around, can't you, with this guy? Three, four, five, six, double GFI. I mean, the wrestler's got to dodge off for two heads. For a double GFI as well. Oh my god, he rolls along. And then rolls another one. Oh my god, and there you go, his offensive drive is in tatters. Never happens to me. Comedy mega diced. So yeah, great start for I Ravel. Even makes the chaff dodge. <laughs> what a what a start! Turn two of your own drive, and they've got the ball, and nothing's in contact, and you've got a stunned guy. Well, yeah, chaff's big favourites now. <laughs> Having two offensive drives. It's not over. Don't say it's over. But it's, uh, you know, there's so much strength on the Chaos team. Two strength up players, in addition to four Warriors. And obviously Horns for strength four or five blitzing every turn. So there's a lot of strength and there's claws. So, you know, there's, they can get back in this, the Chaos. It really isn't over. I think he probably needs to try to engage, right, to try and get these claw mighties firing. But the problem is, in doing so, you get <laughs> you kind of get exposed a bit on the way in. 
guess a lot's going to depend on this. Oh, he doesn't even follow. Oh, well, there is a dirty player there. Yeah. Oof. Oof. I mean, you've got the strength advantage and the claw advantage is the chaos. So you want to be using it. He's got to pile in at some point, you'd think. Oh, wow. Go and piece me like this. I'll just knock everyone down. And get a cheeky foul in on your on your ball, Cavs. Oh, Cav. Oh, it's man. not what I would have done. Oh man. Oh but who's man. To say? Oh How's man. It going, Jimbo? Hello, Dimbo. Did you see that? I did. <laughs> Pretty I was confused. It, it, Twas confusion. Twas confusion, yeah. I mean, this game... The other game was decided in about five turns, and it's looked like this game is... It's not decided yet, is it? But it's, uh, it's really, no, really bad for on me. <clears throat> he's a hedge his bets here. He, I think he needs to go all in. I think he needs to... Honestly, his, his strength is the strength and the claw, and he's, you know, he's allowed himself to be picked up. It's a scary thing to do, though, isn't it, Jim? Well, to be fair. I mean, he's just trading a claw mighty blitz for a claw palm blitz. Every time. <laughs> we know how that one yeah. <laughs> ends up, don't we? Yeah, exactly, and 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 the gang foul, and it, so he's, he's trading a claw mighty blitz for a claw palm blitz and a dirty player gang foul. Every time. I mean, that is Horrendous. not a good trade. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's another guy gone. Oh man. Oh, this, is, this looks like it's leaning into my correlation theory. <laughs> it, it, does, it does look <laughs> like that a little bit. I wonder if uh, we could get the, st the stats from Goblin Spy. You know what I say, we. I mean, BZL. <laughs> <laughs> it definitely not be, mate. <laughs> I wonder if BZL could do it for us. <laughs> or Pedro. He's a spike, doesn't he, Pedro? I don't know. It'll be like 90% of the Chalice games won by the team with 20 arm breaks. It would be interesting, wouldn't it, to see? Yeah, the like the 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 win rate between if there's been if one side has like you know 15 more armor breaks than the other. What, what's what's the win rate between them? <laughs> yeah, but it's all it's all about the first three. Like you get a few couple of lucky ones and that, don't you? But like it's all about the first three turns. So mm -hmm. that's why like the first three turns and the f last three turns of the drive are the most important. Yeah. And go. like under like the basic understanding of whether you're dog or not. Yeah. And uh yeah. It's like chess, isn't it? Like when you're trading but like without equal trades. <laughs> yes. <laughs> like you're like, oh I'm gonna trade this piece for this piece and it's just like but this piece gets removed three times more than this piece. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, well, that that is true, but it was low TV, right? So it didn't take too many on bricks. If my team had been banged out, <laughs> I, yeah, I don't think that's I would super have low TV as well, isn't it? Yeah. Were you playing against orcs? Yeah. Orcs, yeah. I think I have to get eight. 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 Yeah. yeah, it's not twenty, is it? Right. It's not twenty, and I outblocked him as well. Yeah, but elves often do, to be honest. Yeah. I, I often get out, yeah. But, yeah. Yeah. but that, I, I wasn't saying, like, you know, I, I was amazing or anything. I'm just saying, like... Oh, yes, you uh, were. Yeah. No, I wasn't. Like I didn't mean it like that. What I meant was, yeah, low, those low TV games, like, it's it's hard for the... You know, the, the orcs don't have the guard and that, so it's really they hard. They don't have the AG2 just to, like, dodge off and put the assist somewhere else either, do they? So. No, they don't, no. So they and they don't have the block on the uh, the big ones, the uh, black orcs. Mm. Uh, you actually start with the same amount of block as they do, didn't you? If you want, yeah. 
Nice oh yeah, you went with three, yeah, yeah, because you go with the witch. Oh, that's a horrible dub skull. Mm. Huge, only one reroll left. Eats it. Oh, we might have used it earlier. To be honest, I wasn't that's... really paying attention. <clears throat> well, that's the thing with Chorfs as well, they just get to guard much quicker than Chaos do as well. Yeah, yeah, don't have to take block first. But then they are weaker, right? They are. They are only strength three. Okay, this, this case and they're relying on strength. doubles. Yeah, 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 relying on doubles. Yeah, Why has he got Dauntless on that? <laughs> did he take a rando there, did he? <laughs> uh, on this guy. <laughs> on the chorf, the stand firm card chorf, he yeah. took a rando. Um, I mean, there's not much else he can kick, take, right? Like piling on, kick, um, yeah, fend. Right. Piling on. Grab. Yeah, yeah, take grab, mate. Oh, what a skill that is. But Dauntless, you know, it does help in like the uh, Bash Mirrors. And, and bash, mi bash Mirrors as well. Do you reckon he so, leveled so him specifically for this one then? Do you maybe, reckon? maybe, yeah. I mean, there's a lot of. There's 6 strength 4 on this cast team. So, makes sense. Hello, HTK. Pass block. I mean, that's the superior. This isn't even difficult to get through. Wow! Although, it like, kind of, this, this is, this is falling into the realms of trap space, where it's like, if you if you're not, well, like, how is he gonna defend it? Like, he's just gonna put a cage in the same place, I guess. Oh, I don't know about that. Oh. I mean, he scored on his opponent's drive, so it's. Oh, is it? Oh, is this chaos's drive? Yeah. Holy moly. <laughs> there was a short kick blitz into like so Oh okay, in that case, time. yeah, I wouldn't give a shit, yeah. <laughs> Bang it in. <laughs> <laughs> Get it on like Donkey Kong. <laughs> hey. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Chevrons with Stan Firm on the outside. Absolutely brutal. Three hobos on the LOS. Disgusting. Hello, mm. Ancock. Were you, were you three fox hauling, were you? You three? Who three? You three? Well, I mean, you, you've you come into the booth and then HTK and Hancock have turned up. And I know no, they're all... just they're, they're, they're my wingmen, aren't they? They're like... <laughs> just your wingmen. Oh, they? Yeah. No, Hancock <laughs> beat me on Fumble twice today and then uh, mm. I haven't spoken to HTK for a while. Now I played I played a bit of corn. They're mm. terrible, but they're quite fun. <laughs> yeah, they did quite well in the individual standings, surprisingly, you know, in that in the UKTC. Nice. Oh wow, a, a blitz a blitz. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no way. <laughs> With two turns so they can go two and a lot. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Wow, giving him claw hits. Oh, I hate this. I guess <clears> he's <throat> thinking it it could be a touchback, but... I would have liked to see a blitz over here and you know, try and protect the ball and go for the two moon. Yeah, I mean, it's what? Five plus catch on the kickoff. Oh no, he's actually four. four. Yeah, so that's actually three. three. Yeah, so it's a four plus. Oh man. And there's no bulker. Oh, that's scatter. Yeah, there's no bulker anymore for the chaos. Bosh. Bosh. I know I know somebody that would have conceded here probably already. Is <laughs> <laughs> it me, Jim? <laughs> no, 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 no. No? I think I would have done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It's also also is he, he must have appled the, the ball. Yeah, he appled the ball. Okay. I was I didn't see him here, so I thought he hadn't been appled. But I guess he was going to pick it up with a normal guy and then give it oh, to the ball. Oh, that's big, a big huge move. armor break. Mm. Oh, and so that's why he scored. blitzed there because that shuts down the score. So it, so he, he put all the players in there. And blitz there to shut down the score. Yeah, fair enough. 
I think I would have liked a bigger commitment than the Blitz to go 2 0 up though, honestly. Personally. But this is probably more sensible. Oh. <laughs> Pommers always roll pushes, I swear. <laughs> Oh yeah, Chaos ain't scoring, so it's... I don't think Chaucer's scoring either, to be honest. So. No. Oh, maybe. He's got... Where's that hobo? It's the... I mean, it's doable. He could potato with a hobo. It is doable, yeah. I think he should have followed that. Yeah, he's not going for it. I mean, this is going with a guard guy. Yeah, yeah, you can... Oh, he's pushing the wrong square. Yeah, he just got here removes him. So yeah, <coughs> this, this hobo can get in scoring range, right? I would definitely run there. this hobo down the field, so you've got a chance. Yeah. Scoring threats, uh, uh, scoring threats seem horribly <laughs> underrated nowadays. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Instead, he punches a warrior. I mean, it was a really silly uh, threat, right? It was very unlikely to. Yeah, it was like, uh, yeah, it was real low odds, but. <coughs> I guess neither of these boys got any re rolls left either. It is dying to get another bit, yeah. No, I'm just, I'm just saying, like, you know, like, I just looked back and expected to see the ball carry there, and I didn't I figure he would being killed because he, he was killed earlier wasn't he but the apple did work so he's still in it with the chaos yeah the chaos are uh, right exactly where they wanted to be at this point in the game Jim <laughs> yeah I mean no, they're still in it though it's not over don't say it's over it's a bad start but it's not over a bad start yeah But I think he was too tentative. I think that was the problem, right? You've, you've got six strength four. You've got loads of claw mighty. You know, as much guard as them, more or less. So you've, just got to, you've just got to pile in. And uh, take, take a few hits to make a few hits. And then get get this guy cast. <laughs> but like, you can't stop him blitzing with the claw pump. That's, that's the problem, so... Oh, we're going to get a foul in as well. Big foul. Huge foul. Huge. Oh, he's even done a dodge first. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Toxic. <Yeah. laughs> oh, Stun. Diced. And now the Chaos are on defense. Kind of again. They've been on defense three times now. <laughs> Two blitzes. Man. <laughs> it's pretty, that's pretty flippin' unlucky, isn't it? Three defensive drives for the Chaos. <laughs> It definitely must suck as well, like, the one thing that people who watch who don't really play a lot, like, it's not easy to build a Chaos team like this at all, like, you have to put in hours, and then just to, like, get your Chalice game and get blitzed on twice and claw bombed and fouled every turn. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's pretty brutal. Cool. Yeah. Deserve a break. Throne Rock. What they got? Oh, nice weather. I, I genuinely just like imagine one of the warriors is just get killed. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dead. <laughs> Wouldn't even read you. Diced again. Oh my god, oh, that guy died. <laughs> oh, I didn't even read you either, did he? Mm. Wow.
I think I've played Iron Veil vale before. But... <laughs> mm. <laughs> I it... Yeah, I think he dies me like this as well. <laughs> yeah, I've played him before as well. Yeah. I rolled like two powers out of a hundred block dice. <laughs> um, yeah, that's the thing. That, that's why I chose Dark Elves for the Aero BB, because I thought... You know, I, I can I can get level I can level them up quite quickly, and it won't matter that much if they die. Whereas with chaos, as you say, like it takes a lot of work to level up a team, doesn't it? it takes forever, yeah. Like <clears throat> honestly, you you got to be looking at twenty games minimum before they're playable. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah, and then just a random cast can just set you back so far, like so yeah. I mean, dwarves are probably like the best in that. Every player is finished on six SPP, aren't they? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Like Garden, Mighty Blow, like, and then damn firm, and then that's it. But I mean, just Guard is, is that it? You know, like. I mean, Guard is good enough. Yeah, yeah. like you look at PC's fourteen hundred teams that he took to Chalice like regularly and got very far with them. Like you know, he got got himself a wizard every game and yeah. six tacklers, not bad. Yeah. Eight. Nine, ten guarders, like yeah. deal with that, son. Yeah, and obviously all armor nine with thick skull, so unlikely to use them during the matches as well. So I did think of like you know dwarves to be safe, but then I thought the problem is it's just not that fun playing as dwarves, right? And lots of games you're just blocking and not doing a lot. Was I? Hey, you're not going to win five nil with dwarves, that's for sure. Yeah, was I thought with the elves I can. Win five nil, yeah. <laughs> or Daka, you know, da I do Daka. like a Daka. Daka, Daka. <laughs> Here we go again. Yeah, I really do like it. I like a good Daka. Yeah, this game's like. I mean, what do you even do? What do you even do as Chaos? You can't just be trading one blitz, it's like now. No, like, you have to pile in. You have to pile in first half, and I think he's got to pile in now. Like, it, it's not going to be fun to do. But you've just got to do it and hope that he rolls bad and then your counter attacks destroy him basically. Oh removes the dirty player. Mm. He's got a ticket to POM. <laughs> oh he should be in front of him. I guess he's not gonna foul the uh dodge hobo. He's actually men up now, right? He's got ten. ten after this dodge. Yeah, he's got ten versus nine, so he's actually men up on the pitch. Yeah, but he hasn't got the ball. No. Oh, the ball didn't come back. That's huge. Sorry, I didn't notice that. Mm. He pulled centre, not coming back, and it was the good one as well, wasn't it? Yeah. So like, you know, that the, is the chaos, huge. So the, the chaos aren't in like a dominant position here at all. Nah, uh, that's a huge failed KO roll. Mm. I mean, they still have the ball and they don't need to score, is the thing, though, Jim. Yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah, I'd still, I'd still rather be the K. I'd still rather be the choice at this point. But... Okay, now, now it's equal numbers again. They just, <laughs> I just, I just feel like the chaos had to get, in, had to get in, and yeah, that he's lost his carrier. So yeah. It's again. Again. <laughs> again. Yeah. How is yeah. he losing his carrier every single time? I don't know. I don't know, Jeff. Probably wants to use like the strength four more on defense, but it probably shouldn't. Right? <laughs> let them. That's just a G five blitz for the bomber. Um, probably got two stand in the way. Like he's got to get lucky. I, I really think he should have piled in earlier, and probably every turn that's gone by, he should have piled in, <laughs> even though he hadn't. He's on a clock, yeah, he's on a clock. Oh, that's a huge stun. That's quite a nice stun. Mm. Everyone. Well, if you're going to do that blitz, you should have already stood up your claw bomber. Oh, I thought he was going to blitz with the claw bomber. Yeah, I thought he was going to blitz that chore. GFI hit the... Uh, oh, and he gets wrestled. Knight. How did GFI hit the claw knight? Saves you doing the dodge as well, doesn't it? Yeah, I would. Yeah, I would. One hundred percent pom the chorf. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, 
I, I'm not. I don't give a shit about that hobo in the backfield. <laughs> yeah, and he's got to get lucky a bit as well. So it helps you get lucky by running the crowd. Right, yeah, you should have just piled in. Like every turn, I still think you should be piling in, even though now he's you know he's in a much worse spot to pile in, and it's probably the wrong thing to do. But yeah. still, how else is he going to get the ball? Like he he still has to now. Now it's now it's probably the wrong decision, but it's just absolute desperation stakes at this point. I mean, he can stop him. He can stop him scoring and lose one nil, but <laughs> you don't get anything for that. <laughs> it was like that final, wasn't it? It wasn't the last final. I think it was the one before that. I can't remember, but um, Dark Elves versus Chaos. And Dark Elves scored on Chaos's drive, and then there was just like no real attempt from Chaos to get the ball back on the other <laughs> drive. He did amazing stopping him, like getting an easy score, but then just never really pressured him to yeah. Yeah, I remember get that, the ball actually, back. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's hard though, right? It's hard because if you press, oh, it's incredibly him, hard. You yeah. Go pass and score too, but and, but the chaos don't really have that concern with the, with the chores, do they? It's not as if the chores can just. Skip you just got to them. rip the band aid off and accept that you're losing, right? It's just, yeah. <laughs> it's just like if I don't do anything, I'm just gonna lose slowly. Yeah. He just doesn't oh, want to get I... his men in in the mixer, does he? Like he just does not want to engage. You know? Like, yeah, okay, I mean the chores. He's in a core pond, but you still had to engage, I think. The chores are just going to blitz this rookie lino and move over to the left. Yeah, mm. it's not even a difficult decision. It's just like, yeah. And he knows he's not getting fouled because he hasn't been fouled for ages, so he's just going to leave that chalk on the floor. Probably move back to him next turn. Yeah. It's a simple decision that's with no real consequences. That stun means he can put the ball wherever the fuck he wants, and it doesn't really matter. Yep. Oh, he should have used the he should have used a stun body as a screen. It would have been, been better. <laughs> Hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I mean, there's a four plus three plus to get pommed here. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's he's, he's 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 totally shut it down now with that. The G5 oh. and the dodge. Yeah. This, what about this guy? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, this guy can do it. No, he hasn't. Oh, fuck off. Let's pause it. This guy could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI, and he probably should have done. Yeah. Four, three, two, two to hit the ball is better than just waiting to lose. <laughs> But then you know if you do that, you, then your strength four guy gets claw pond. But that, that, that's yeah. it. He's going to blitz somebody every turn, right? Like it doesn't matter what you do, someone's getting blitzed. So he should have just piled in when he had the four warriors, and the, you know he should have just piled in at that point. And then, I mean, how many guard does the chaos dwarves have? Three, four, five, six, six. And he had one, two. Two. <laughs> uh, not many. <laughs> yeah, I can't see the dead ones. Because not many. There was one dead one. Three. Guard. Yeah, so only he only had three guard, and actually is not that good. But still, he had he had three guard, so he's down two guard, but he was up four strength. So you'd have to think, you know, he could have done something right to uh, to get some kind of good trades there and try and limit the chances of the claw mighty to hit good players. And then open up Claw Mighty hits for his own players. Yeah, what you could do is, Ducky, you could just make like the playoffs res, like they are in the ball three. Can, could have been a decision. <laughs> I mean, obviously, the ball three was necessitated by it being impossible to play leagues. <laughs> but it would be a possibility to make the playoffs res. It would make the playoffs more competitive, but then it would change the way people play ladder, I reckon, as well. Yeah, it would be interesting. It would be interesting. Who can say if it would be good or bad? At the, you know, at the end of the day, it just... It would, like, massively favour Elves like, yeah. and Edge. Like, it's just so much of a swing in the meta that it would literally just be everyone trying to qualify Woodies. But still, everybody would still play loads of bash, right? People just like playing bash more. And they would lose first round of Chalice every season. <laughs> like, a couple of seasons where we've seen Chaos go out, 
completely in round one, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, just a rookie. Mm. This is, uh, is there anything on here? <clears throat> no, probably not. Probably not. Yeah, he, does, he did go in. Yeah, he just didn't go in very yeah. hard. Well, he's, he's run out of things to go in with, hasn't he? Yeah. That's the thing, isn't it? That's... Yeah. But he's got instant results when he has done. How funny is that? Ooh. He's got to hit on the ball next time. Well, not quite. Oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> guaranteed, yeah. Yeah. As long as he can push that guy, he's got... He can... he's, he's in guard, so it's... Is he strength four? So... He can get... Oh, no, the wrestle's he's not... He's got strength. a guard in here. Oh, but he's got two. Mm. What he, he I think I think he should have tried to clear the strength four guy there. Yeah. Oh, but he doesn't really have guard, though, does he? I guess he's gonna red dice with wrestle. Oh no, he's got a guard in there, so he just blitzed, he just blitzed a random fella. Yeah, he could have one deed. One deed the ball was better than blitzing a random fella. <laughs> he's realised. He's realised that he's losing one nil, so he's he's just geified this guy. Into oh yeah. Range. Oh shit! It's turn sixteen. <laughs> well, I guess that makes more sense then, like, because he's he needed a scoring threat, and that's yeah, quite... yeah. So he had to blitz there to get him through, yeah. But it's all a bit late, isn't it? It's all... It is late. It's very late. But is it too late? Uh, to apologise, I think mm. so, yeah. I wonder if, rather than doing this, he should have just, you know, hit the claw panel and then blitz the one guy in scoring range. I mean, I'm not an expert, but I feel like that might have been... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Jim, I don't probably say this often, but you are bloody good at Blood Bowl, mate. Oh, he's so lovely, didn't he? Uh, oh, <laughs> he's gonna run away. Isn't he? He's probably unhittable by anything anyway. So yeah, he will be. Yeah. Could have done that before he took that block. He could have done that yeah before any of the blocks. He could have just instantly <laughs> gone there. <laughs> I mean, just quietly. <laughs> yeah, but he could have just done that instantly. But yeah, that was bit of a shambles really from Eskazer and like you know he, he had the worst dice obviously double blitzed and out bashed pretty heavily but I feel like he never never gave himself the best chance that he could have. It's been. hard mate that, like that's the irony of it is that he's a killer claw team and he's obviously scared of the killer claw team but <laughs> yeah. it is hard like when you just like everything in your head is going like no don't base like no Yep. But he also got screwed over by the kickoff events as well. Oh yeah. Yep, no doubt about that. So it's like, yeah, but second half definitely too passive, in my opinion. Yeah, but both halves I thought he was too passive. But is what it is. Uh, the guy with 20 AV breaks wins the match. <laughs> oh, amazing, Jim. Wow. Commiserations, Eskiza. Congratulations, I'm Rebel. Thank you very much, Dimmy. Been glorious having you in the booth. Absolutely fantastic. Stay. Hey, Marmalade. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>